Welcome back, everyone. You know, it's important to be very careful when you are cooking that big meal tomorrow. News Channel 6's Chloe Salsameda has some tips to keep you safe. There's less than 24 hours till all the ovens are going to be fired up for Thanksgiving. And if you're cooking this year, you have to remember to be extremely careful in the kitchen. Hospitals see a surge in burn patients during the holidays, and firefighters get lots of calls about cooking fires. This year, there will be plenty of first-time cooks preparing Thanksgiving dinner. Whether you're cooking a 20-pound turkey or smaller Cornish hens, medical professionals are asking you to be extremely careful around the hot stove and oven. During the holidays, cooking injuries are at their highest. One of the most common injuries, burns. Come to the hospital if you have sustained burns to your hands, feet, face, um, if you have uncontrollable pain. If the burn is bigger than the palm of your hand, you're probably going to need some medical care. Chloe Salsameda, WJBF, News Channel 6. Local families were able to get a Thanksgiving meal today and register to vote at the same time. News Channel 6's Darnisa Jefferson has the story. Cars were lined around the block today. As the Greater Augusta's Interfaith Coalition partnered with the Black Matters Fund to provide Thanksgiving meals for dozens of families and help people get registered to vote ahead of the Georgia Senate runoff race in January. Greater Augusta's Interfaith Coalition was able to get about 450 boxes of food as well as fresh produce to families in need for Thanksgiving. The event was also an opportunity to get people registered to vote ahead of the Senate runoff race in January. Organizers say it's important for voters to turn out in the Senate runoff race to have a say in important issues on the ballot. So it's not just about the personalities and the candidates, it's about these issues that our community is dealing with on a daily basis. If we care about those issues, we need everybody to turn out and show out and show out. December 7th is the last day to register to vote for the runoff race, and December 14th is the first day of early voting. In Augusta, Dear Nisa Jefferson, WJBF, News Channel 6. Looks like a nice day out there.